Every hero has a sidekick. The sidekick does all the little things while the hero saves the world. The MacBook, hero material. And the all-in-one is the Tonto to the MacBook's Lone Ranger, the Robin to its Batman, the Gilligan to its Skipper. This is Epson CX7000F. It's an all-in-one that is the perfect companion to the MacBook. Now I want to run over the feature set of this all-in-one so that when you go sidekick shopping, you're going to know which one to get. Now this all-in-one really does everything. It is the complete package. It's a color scanner, color printer, color fax machine, as well as black and white fax. It'll print photos. It can copy, do enlargements and reductions in black and white and in color. Now a really important thing to look for when you're looking at any printing device is the ink system. Now the Epson uses Durabrite ink. Now why is that so important? Well quality is one issue and Durabrite inks are pigment based inks that provide superior quality. But for students, durability is also very important and these inks are water, smudge and light resistant. So when you print off a project your work's going to look great even if your prof ends up using your paper as his coffee coaster. They've also got some really neat additional features built into it that make it really fit well in the environment of a student's life. For example, there's a really cool feature called fit to page when you're doing copying. You know how if you lay down a book quite often you have to print two pages uh, off in order to have both pages of the book because it's larger than eight and a half by 11? Well, they've got a fit to page feature which will reduce the size automatically to fit on an eight and a half by 11 sheet. So that's one creative way of reducing the waste on paper and also making things a lot more convenient. It's a versatile printer. It'll handle all sorts of projects, brochures, it'll do all your reports and it handles them very elegantly. Now as far as photo printing, you can reprint photos, you can do enlargements, you can also scan photos in and even do restoration with software that's built in with the Epson. Now it's got memory card slots so you can plug your digital camera's memory card directly into it and print directly out of it. And it also has something called PicBridge which is how we connect a lot of different cameras and connect directly and print directly from the camera. So this device also works very well standalone. I mean all of the copying, all of the faxing features work fine without a computer and you can also do all of the photo printing features without the computer so it's a nice standalone device. One other nice feature is how it handles double-sided printing or duplexing. Now it doesn't have an automatic duplexing attachment. You have to flip the paper over manually but the Epson drivers on the Mac are really nice in telling you where to turn and giving you diagrams on how to place the paper back in so you can properly print on both sides of a sheet. And you should consider using double-sided paper. I know all paper has two sides. Steve knows that, but I'm talking about using a heavier stock because when you're printing with inkjet paper and with inkjet ink on paper, it'll bleed through a bit. So you want to use a little bit thicker stock if you're going to be printing on two sides so everything looks really good. Now the price for this unit is about $129 currently. Now if you're looking at this, as a parent and experiencing a little bit of all-in-one jealousy, thinking, oh, the kids at school are going to have a better device than I have at home, well, then you should consider treating yourself to the big brother of the CX7000F, which is the Epson RX595. Now, this does everything the CX does, but it does it with home users and photo enthusiasts in mind. See, there are really two classes of all-in-ones. You got your basic productivity all-in-ones and you have your photo all-in-ones. The difference is really the ink systems where the 4-ink Durabrite inks in the CX7000F is designed for productivity, office documents and a little bit of photo or image work. The RX595 uses Epson's Claria High Definition ink. The Claria High Definition inks are dye based systems, a 6-ink system that's built from the ground up for printing photos and it's perfect for the photo enthusiast. It'll even print directly onto CDs and DVDs and it only costs about $50 more than the CX7000F. Now regardless of which system you choose, you're going to get a real sense of satisfaction by putting your best foot forward. Hey, superheroes need sidekicks because they make them look good. And in these all-in-ones, well, they make us look good. So who's the superhero now?